Welcome back to the channel guys, it is me, AD744. So today guys, we'll be talking about with you guys the MLS uh, Conference Semifinals 2023. So we're going to keep this short and sweet for you guys. There will be times in the description below. And like I said guys, we're going to go ahead and go over my predictions. We'll also look back at the um, the quarterfinals, round one instance, and just look back how I did. And of course, um, like I said guys, um, so let me know how you guys did in the comments below guys. So let's go look at my let's go look at the results first, and then we'll talk about my predictions. So FC Cincinnati beat New York Red Bulls. Now I did predict that, so I got one point for that. Let's go. It ended up being a quite comfortable, you know, two out of three. Orlando City beat Nashville. Now this is where I got wrong. I messed up. Well, I predicted Nashville to advance. Orlando actually did advance to the end. Okay. Then moving on, we have Columbus Crew versus Atlanta United. Now I did predict that one to correct, so I did predict that one. I went to a third leg. Then Philadelphia Union versus New England Revolution. I predicted Philadelphia Union to win, and they did win, so congratulations to them. St. Louis City versus Sporting Kansas. Now, I actually went went with St. Louis City. They actually messed up. It was Sporting Kansas that advanced. The Seattle Sounders versus FC Dallas. I actually went with Dallas to advance, so that, got, that was wrong. Uh, then Houston Dynamo versus Real Salt Lake. I predicted that one correctly, and then I predicted LAFC to beat Vancouver. So overall, I did pretty solid for this one. I got... Um, uh, five out of eight. So I'm I'm pretty happy with that. I think that's a fair predictions, and um, let's see how I do for the semifinals, man. And remember, guys, the semifinals are one legged. It's one matchup, so there is no do overs. Okay, let's start with the Eastern Conference first. Let's start with the Eastern Conference first. So we have our first matchup was Orlando City versus Columbus Crew. This is an interesting one. Orlando City they got the job done against Nashville. Won both games one nil away. Columbus, excuse me, Columbus Crew had to take it to them. It's a difficult one, man. It's a difficult one. I think I'm going to go with Orlando City. I feel like for me, Columbus Crew, I don't feel like they can travel as well. And they only just won the home games against Atlanta United. That's what makes me a bit concerned. Is that Whereas Orlando City, on the other hand, they defeated both games, right? So I'm going to go with Orlando City just about. But... I could see Columbus Crew maybe do it. So, I think for Columbus Crew, they have to take this to penalties. Extra time or penalties for them to prevail. Next up is FC Cincinnati versus Philadelphia Union. Cincinnati have been tremendous. You know, obviously, the best team in Eastern Conference. Uh, Philadelphia Union, team that's been looking to do this. I just think Philadelphia Union haven't been the same. I feel like this team hasn't been the same as they previously are. I feel like this team is kind of regressing. And as much as I want them to win... um. Make the Eastern Conference Final. I just feel like for me, FC Cincinnati have too much quality. Especially them being at home. I just feel like for me, Philadelphia Union, it's going to be very difficult for them to pull this off. That being said, though, Philadelphia Union did beat New England Revolution um, both games home and away. Whereas FC Cincinnati, I believe they only won at home. They um, they technically tied away um, and went to penalties. So I just think that for me, for Philadelphia, man, I would like for them to prevail. But I just don't see them doing it. Next up for the Western Conference, we have is Houston Dynamo versus Sporting Kansas City. Wow, shout out to Sporting Kansas City. They actually did the unthinkable. They actually knocked out the league leaders, which is something I did not expect. And that's going to be interesting because I just think it's going to be difficult to call with this one because Houston Dynamo are such a good team. They play so good football. I'm going to go with Houston Dynamo, though. I think Houston Dynamo will pre prevail on that one. Um, I just feel like for me, they're just a well, better team, cohesion. I just think the players will perform well, and I just think they'll do it. Uh, I'll probably have the head-to-head -head here on the screen so you guys can check it out uh, while I'm going through these matchups. Uh, then we have a final matchup, which is Seattle Sounders versus LAFC. It's a very tricky one, guys. Seattle Sounders have been amazing. And LAFC, of course, we know how good they are. Mm, I'm going to go with LAFC, unfortunately, though. I feel like Seattle Sounders, for me, as much as I don't want Seattle, as much as I want Seattle Sounders to do it, I think LAFC have too much quality. They have too much quality, and I think they're going to prevail. So those are, are my uh, predictions. So basically, I went with all the home teams to progress, except with the exception of the away team being LEFC. Um, and it's going to be interesting to see how this ages, man, because it's going to be interesting indeed. So remember, guys, these are one-legged, one matchup. Um, you know, and um, I do think that we're going to see some upsets, even though I did not predict. I don't. Did I predict any upsets? I don't think I did. Um, but we're going to see some upsets. Just, just, just be aware. And obviously, we have the Eastern Conference final, December second. Western Conference um, final December 2nd, and then obviously MLS Cup December 9th. So it's going to be very interesting to see how that pans out. So I want to know your guys' predictions in the comments below, guys. 
Um, remember, guys, to like and subscribe if you did enjoy. And uh, let me know what you guys think, man. Uh, what predictions you agree with, what predictions you disagree with. I kept this relatively short and concise for you guys uh, because I went through the players in the previous round, so I didn't really feel like repeating the players right here in this video. So, yeah, make sure you guys also consider becoming a member of the channel, get access to members, members' videos, member streams. And, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.